Good evening, everybody. My name is Carla, and you've reached my floss tube channel, Carla Being Crafty. Um, today is another extra video, not my regular crafting videos, and it is number three in my Moving Chronicles saga. Um, today is Sunday. It's the 25th of August, which means that I will be moving in a month from tomorrow because I'm going to actually be moving on the 26th of September officially. So I have four more weekends to um, get this place packed up. And next weekend is a three-day weekend, so that's great. Um, so I'll have an extra day. Um, whether that means I, I do more packing or just I have an extra day to relax is, is it remains to be seen. Um, I've decided that I'm going to go over to Lorraine's on one of the days, one of the weekend days every, every weekend. My hair is all... Um, <laughs> uh, because honestly, um, I don't want to work myself to the point of, um, not being able to move. And I am noticing my body is, has been in pain. Um, just from starting to do this, um, my knees are, are getting really, really sore and my back and stuff. So, um, I can put in a one really good weekend day of packing and then a little bit in the evenings and stuff. Um, and I, I think I'm going to, I'm going to do fine. Um, so today was, uh, the memorial or actually it was a celebration of life for my friend who passed away, um, for Kip. It was at the theater, saw a ton of people I haven't seen in years and years and years. So although it was, it was for a sad reason, it actually was kind of a happy day and everybody was just telling stories and just, you know, reminiscing about this wonderful person who we all lost, um, so in some ways it was, it was very heartwarming and happy, um, for a general sad reason, but you know, um, the theater community tends to do that kind of celebration of life type thing. And we all just get together and we tell, we tell theater stories, um, about the person and it was, it was nice. I went to Long Beach. I picked Lorraine up. She actually had ordered brunch for us, which was really nice. And then I drove her, you know, to and from the the celebration of life thing. Um, so yeah, um, it was a pretty good day. I'm, I'm pretty tired to be honest. I did work really hard yesterday with the packing and stuff. Um, so I'm going to turn the camera around kind of like I did last week so you guys can see the progress. Um, hopefully you'll be able to see that there are more boxes. Um, okay. So I'm going to try and do it slow and, um, I have two big dressers there. Um, let's see. So both of those big dressers, both the tall one, which is over there, and then the long one, which you can't even see anymore, are completely empty. So although that's the kind of thing that like you don't see, uh, see it because you're emptying out something, you know, that is a big job. So those are both done. You can see all of the boxes that are starting to pile up. I'm trying to keep everything sort of organized and so I still have a path you know to to the cat tree and everything like that um so hopefully you guys saw that pretty well um so during the course of this week I mean obviously I'm still working you know full time so when I get home um I I have a couple things I'm trying to like in my mind decide you know what can I do just a little bit each night. Um, so I have like all these different carts of things and I have gone through them, thrown away a bunch of stuff. Um, so they're not like ready to be packed yet because it's stuff that I use, but um, I have started. Uh, I started putting all of my cross stitch charts and cross stitch magazines and stuff in boxes and almost done with that. I have like it's two, it's gonna just be two boxes and I, I filled one and the other one I half filled and then I have a shelf that I haven't gotten yet because it's down low and I didn't want to bend, <laughs> to be honest. Um, so yeah, so that's basically where I'm at. Um, I, I'm tired. I'm tired all the time, but you know, that's just going to be par for the course. Um, and I am glad that we have a three day weekend next weekend. Um, as I said, I think I'm going to go over to the, to the rains, to the house. Um, on Saturday, I'm going to bring a bunch of laundry and I'm going to do my laundry 
while I'm there. And then some of it I'm going to leave. Like stuff I don't need, I'm going to leave. And then some of the stuff, you know, I'm going to bring back because I still need to get dressed every day. Um, and then I might bring, I might bring some bedding, stuff like that. I'm not sure. Um, then I'm going to be a packing monster on Sunday. Um, hopefully I'll check in with you guys again on that day. And then Monday, since it's a holiday day, I might try and do a little bit or I might really just relax. Um, it's just going to depend on how my body's feeling. My knees are really sore right now. Um, I think I'm going to get an ice pack and see if that helps. I haven't done that in a really long time, but I'm thinking like it might be a smart thing to do to try and ice my knees. And, um, I have noticed all week that it's been really hard when I stand up. Once I stand up and move around, they're not quite as bad, but that first initial standing up, they're, they're really bad. Um, and I know it's partly, it's just from getting up and down and up and down and up and down while I'm doing all this packing and stuff. Um, so yeah. Um, I think that's about it. I know this is like super short. Um, there was something else I want to tell you guys. Oh, I know what I want to tell you guys. So a couple nights this week, um, when I had packed a box or whatever and decided didn't want to do anything else, um, I did work, did a little crochet actually. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to open this bag with one hand. So yeah, I was working on my, uh, this lazy, lazy scarf. Um, this one, um, that is going to be a gift and it's really pretty. I think, I mean, I, I made the other one and I showed you guys, um, but it's, you know, it's just single crochet and it's just done with the mandala, um, the mandala yarn. This one is, um, where's the color? Snorks. This is Snorks. And, um, and it just, it looks lacy because you do it with a very, very large crochet hook. So. I did work on this a couple nights. First night I pulled it out to work on and um, ended up spending most of my time um, unraveling the stupid ball of yarn because it was just in a big tangle. You know, it had the yarn barf and then it was all tangled and so I had to roll it into a ball and that just basically took all evening. But I managed to roll it into a ball. I have this much left and then this is a gift for my friend. But it is turning out really pretty, I think. Um, yeah, so I actually did actually do a little bit of crafting this week. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Um, other than that, uh, my life is just consumed right now with regular work and then um, packing, getting ready to move. So I changed my address with the post office. I changed my, um, voter registration cause this is not the year to not vote. So I am voting. <laughs> um, and I wanted to make sure that I got my ballot sent to the right place with the right County cause I am changing counties. Um, and, uh, yeah. And I started to look into all the other stuff that I have to change cause I have a lot of professional designations and stuff that I have to change the address on that. So I started looking into that and, um, I think I'm on the right track. So I think that's about it for today. I am really tired. It's about quarter to eight. So I don't know if this is going to upload really quick or if it's not going to get uploaded till tomorrow. Um, but, uh, this is going to be a either falling asleep early night or just lying and being a couch potato for a couple hours and then falling asleep night. So anyway, thank you guys for following along on this crazy little journey that I'm on. And, um, you know, I can't wait to, to be on the other end and share like the organization and how I'm going to reorganize, you know, my crafts and in a new space and, you know, how I'm going to do all that. It's going to, it's going to be weird for me because honestly, I'm going to have more than one place to craft right now. Basically I do all of my cross stitch and crochet, you know, on my day bed, but, uh, I'm going to have a living room to go and spend the evening in and, you know, 
or I could do it in my room, you know, so that, that's going to be weird for me. I think I'm going to have to take one of my carts and actually make like a craft cart that can move from room to room um, for projects that I'm currently working on, which is completely different than what I have right now, you know. Um, so that's kind of exciting, though. Um, so, yeah, now I'm just rambling and I'm tired, so I don't want to start repeating myself. Um, but thank you guys for for sticking with me during this this time. And um, I will be back next week and hopefully I will be able to show you more stuff. Actually, I may not because if I record on Sunday morning, it will be before I start doing stuff on Sunday. But anyway, um, I hope you have a great week. I hope you have a great crafty week. I hope the weather is nice where you are, et cetera, et cetera. And until I see you again, please remember to be content, be kind, and be crafty. This is Carla. Bye-bye.